Well, thank you all for coming uh, to the President's Showcase of Undergraduate Research Excellence. Um, it's an awesome time for us to celebrate the incredible research endeavors of our undergraduates here. It's going to start moving like this thanks to the lens course, and it just starts developing a movement like this. It goes around like 13 million times a second. This is the highest profile event we do all year. We give almost $100,000 in research funding to students to do creative and research projects all across campus and over the all over the, uh, the world, too. And tonight they're coming together to celebrate and present and showcase their work to the university community. Being an under, un, undergrad in research here is a very unique experience because not every school does that. Um, the graduate students and the faculty over in the biology department have treated me like another grad student. Um, and even though it brings benefits, as in I, I get to go to lab meetings, I get to go to group discussions, they're, they're also expecting a whole new level of things from me. Um, they they want to see a good project that is meaningful. They don't just want to see a high school experiment. Most people, when we say research, especially freshmen, they think test tube, white lab coat with a beaker. And, uh, and that's a lot of our job, is to dispel that myth, to help students think about research and creative, creative inquiry across the disciplines, across the endeavor. Every faculty member at a major research university is doing research. They have to, and that's part of their job. And every discipline has new questions, important questions that we need to answer um, in, in, the, in communities, uh, and in, in scientific disciplines, and in creative arts. And that helps enrich, enrich our world. And uh, we need more students involved in this, and that helps them become better thinkers and better problem solvers who then get, uh, who go into graduate school, become professors, and go into industry, and enrich our communities and our world.